the peninsula of Inkailoch Island is known as Otter Point due to its high incidence of otter sightings. If you're looking for an otter in the wild, it's those remnants of their former presence which you look for. So you look for the footprints, the pads, which you'll see the webbing, which are you know, particularly unusual. Then they have these long tails, these long muscular tails, which almost act like propellers to move really quickly in the water when they're chasing eels and fish. They have very thick fur. They have two layers of fur, which, you know, firstly that helps them remain warm. Also, when, when you see otters underwater, and you see the bubbles, sort of the chain of bubbles going to the surface. That's the air which has been locked within those fur, that fur, to keep them warm. And to a certain extent, make them buoyant. It's more so in sea otters, but also Eurasian. Uh, they have very, very sharp teeth, which allows them to basically crunch into crustaceans. Their whiskers, something else, you know, they've got these really long whiskers. You see a cat and think, oh, wow, look at them. You see an otter and they go across the whole face. And again, that's for when they're underwater, it senses the prey. So if they're after fish, that helps sense where those, that, those prey animals are. 